you right now, but I don't know the rules of the game if I'm allowed to say it. Say it. You'll be okay. Um, One of my boys, a social media influencer, this was early back in like 2018. What, what's one of your boys? I'm not going to expose him because he says some viable shit, but he was at a Diddy party and they invited him to Diddy's room. He walks in, Trey Songs was sitting on Diddy's lap making out with him and they asked him if he wanted to join. What the f No, ain't no way. Ain't no They're way. all gay. They're all undercover gays. I promise you that. I promise Jesus. you that. Damn. I could That's say like something that. about a Diddy party right now, but I don't know the rules of the game if I'm a. Damn. So, I mean, just get used to shit like this coming out. It's about to be more. Y'all about to hear a lot. Because trust me, it's people that have industry secrets that are now going to start joining in the train, the exposed train, that's going to start spilling shit out. Now that they got him behind. You know, when he's still freeing on the streets, people are scared. Oh, no, he's going to, you know, because they like, then he got a bag. He'll put a hit on you. He'll do this. You know what I mean? He's behind jail. He's locked up, but they got the monster. He in a cage. So now I'm going to come out and say what I want to say. That's what will be happening, bro. It's going to be people now who feel safe, and they're going to come out and start telling their stories. And they're going to volunteer them without nobody asking. Watch. It's going to be people just volunteering them on Twitter, on their, on their social media, or just going live on Instagram and just, I can't hold this anymore. I got to talk about the time when boop, boop. Watch. Remember Pun told you. I'm telling you. This shit is about to be a big fucking deal, bro. And when something like this happens, all kind of people start coming out the woodworks. Every time. It happened with, y'all saw it happen with R. Kelly. Niggas knew about R. Kelly peeing on a bitch since we was young. Everybody knew it was a VHS tape with R. Kelly peeing on the bitch. People were selling the tape. It was hood viral. Y'all remember, if y'all from that era, y'all remember. Then uh, him dating Aaliyah and Nigga, all this shit. Little girl, boo, boo, boo. This is shit the entertainment business knew. The industry knew. We was fucking in high school. Like, the industry knew. That's how long it's been. And it took for them to come 20 years later to grab the nigga up. And then not only that, when they came to grab him up, they put out a fucking series on that nigga. And they put out the series before they grabbed him up. So that persuaded everybody's mind that he was a monster. So when they came and grabbed him up, pff, nobody cared. Everybody was like, no, nah, he deserved to go in there. They did him cold. Now, did he deserve that? Yeah, if you did all those shits to them girls and all that, yeah, for sure. Hey, shout out to you for watching that clip. Now be sure to smash the like and download Underdog Fantasy. All you have to do is pick higher or lower on players and you can win big. If you want to make some extra cash and have more fun while you watch sports, download Underdog and get up to a thousand times bonus cash. Just use my code, Ace Boys.